Hey guys, it's been long four days, uh, but I finally got the battery box on today. Uh, this is just, uh, um, I got the, um, this was actually designed for a 12S, a 12S 2P, a dual air. I was going to actually put the vest on this side. It's actually for a small board, um, but I didn't have a battery box that fitted, so I was able to fit a 12S 2P. And I can fit another uh, something on top, so I put the vest here. So, sort of a waste of room here. Maybe I can make it like a 12S3P. Uh, then that would actually fit perfect. I'm not sure. But for right now, again, this is just a prototype. And uh, finally it works. And I've installed a, a DC jack. Make sure you guys get the weatherproof thing. Because, uh, for example, if you get a splash of water, that could short out your uh, BMS, right? Because that's your charge port, so you don't want to get water in there. So I applied a bunch of uh, hot glue here on the inside. And then I have a neoprene. This really stops all the rattles and whatnot. So there should be zero rattling. Um, so neoprene, very good stuff. That's going to absorb everything. And uh, this is covering the bottom of the whole battery box. So once I flip it over and, and also one thing I did different is uh, uh, I noticed that like boards, like Chinese boards, especially they have these little screw ins and then it's you screen the opposite way. The problem is, you, you know, sometimes when you're taking it out, if it gets rusty, you can strip the screws while taking it out. And then it's just a pain to fix that. A better way to do it is just have the screws come in from the top and you can um, you can uh, what I did is put epoxy on top of the screw so this doesn't move so that way when I plug it in all I have to do is uh, pop the box on and then I can just screw it in and when I want to screw it off I can screw it off uh, with the skate tool I don't have to bother uh, with the other side ever I unscrew the nuts pop the box out just makes everything so much simpler and this this is waterproof because there is epoxy on top here that's covering the hole um, so you can keep it uh, waterproof I think this is the best method this is actually the first time I'm trying this method but uh, I've noticed you know if you can just unscrew the nuts and take the box out it just makes your life simpler because you don't have to deal with the other side put your board on the other side you can just lay it down Unscrew the nuts and boom shaka. Um, I'm glad I got this done in four days. It was just a lot of work. I was gonna actually duct tape it, but then I was gonna I'm probably gonna take this to Korea soon and then um I'm gonna probably ride it in somewhat winter conditions, maybe ice. <laughs> let's check out the uh let's check out the 